What if Victor Wembanyama was the number one pick over LeBron James in the 2003 draft? How drastically would NBA history change? With the Cleveland Cavaliers, would Victor Wembanyama be able to do what LeBron James could never win an NBA championship without needing to take his talents to South Beach first? Or with a loaded veteran Detroit Pistons, would it be LeBron James who would find tremendous success early and make a much better case that he is indeed basketball's GOAT? As you're about to see, putting Victor Wembanyama in the 2003 draft would change everything. With the first pick, in the 2003 NBA Draft, the Cleveland Cavaliers select Victor Wimbanyama. What's up guys, Mike here, and today we are making big time moves. Because today we are looking at what if Victor Wembanyama was in LeBron James draft class, AKA the incredible draft class of 2003, which also has Carmelo Anthony, Dwayne Wade, Chris Bosh, and Jeffrey. Glover. Kidding about Glover. Today we are doing what happens when Victor Wembanyama is in a LeBron James draft class. But also, we are going to track everything with the reason being, I want to see what era Wemby is the best in. Is he the best in the 2000s? Is he the best in the 90s against Michael Jordan and a young Kobe? Or is he the best in the 80s versus Magic and Bird? Or is he the best in the modern NBA? We are going to find out and then, I'll just spoil it, we're going to keep going. We're going to see what happens if we take a young Steph Curry, a young LeBron James, a young Kevin Durant, a young Michael Jordan. We're going to drop them into these what if era challenges and create a leaderboard and see who is the ultimate goat who is the best player from each era in terms of everything i'm incredibly incredibly excited to get going so mr david stern commissioner all right great to see him back and great to see him giving us that man victor Wembenyama. draft express number four are we sure about that ceiling not available. In the famous words of Michael Jordan, the ceiling is the roof. As we take the number one pick, I want to kind of go over the rules very quickly. On my end, I am going to be trying to win as much as possible with Victor Wembanyama. As we see LeBron James, number two, Detroit Pistons. They win the title in 2004, the season we're starting on, with Darko, who is just a trivia answer at this point. No offense. Anyway, I will be on my end trying to win as much as possible as Melo goes number three ahead of Darko. Where's Darko? Denver Nuggets, though, they don't believe. On the other end, though, I have to let the NBA just run itself. Dwayne Wade, number four to the Toronto Raptors. That's what I'm talking about. Here we go. Dwayne Wade, Vince Carter vibes. This is how we're letting the NBA run. Number five, Chris Bosh, Miami Heat. He's getting there early. Does Chris Bosh have the pull to get LeBron and Wade there? Is Detroit one of the greatest cities in America? As LeBron James brings Wade and Bosh there, we will see. We are going to just finish this draft. We have a lot to be tracking, and we have an 84 overall victory. Wembenyama. Other notable changes. Jay Glover. Don't sleep. <laughs> what did they do to my man Kirk? No one rocks the Rex specs even. No one even tries that. But I will say, I am repping for today. 75th anniversary logo. We repping. However, as we see, there are some steals here, like David West to the Lakers. Now, does he become David West or does Glover become the real star? I'm not sure, but we do see Darko, an 18 year old Darko to the Utah Jazz. Do you believe in Darko? We want Victor Wembanyama to be the GOAT. We do not want LeBron James winning the 2004 NBA championship, of course. I'll say there's a bit of realism here. I'm not gonna immediately go Tim Duncan, Victor Wembanyama. The franchise at one point was one of the best point guards in the NBA. NBA, as you can see, 21.6 points, seven assists per game. We get Ron Artest. Okay, Marion or, or Artest? We want a defensive stud. Ron Artest is St. John's. I'm St. John's. You may have noticed we have to trade away big contracts. So we got Ilgowskis. We literally are bringing Jeffrey Glover on the squad. I'm not even kidding. Yes, here we go. Okay, so we're bringing in Larry Hughes a score right away. And now that gives us 6.7 million. We have to keep going. Ricky Davis was famous at the time for saying that they did not need LeBron James on their team, the Cleveland Cavaliers. Michael Red, the case of a lights out shooter. This is that's nutty. This is a squad. We are breaking the mold of the NBA, and I love it. We're giving it all to Tim Thomas. We have five million. We can't just waste that five million. Renounce the rights. Does that give us? Renounce. Go away. Be gone with you. Peter Turkaloo. 
I do know about it. I'm gonna front load this contract because sorry, he do. Just like that. Michael Red, 86. I mean, I think we can agree that this is a team we can believe in. We want to be competing right away. And so looking at the power rankings, we have the Spurs, with we can see Prime Tony, a very old David Robinson, Jermaine O'Neal. Lakers got Kobe and Shaq. So first of all, where, where's our competition? Detroit Pistons, Boozer and LeBron, the Cavalier connection we never had. Toronto Raptors right away with Dwayne Wade and Vince were number 25. That's not even our team. We're not starting Milt. So, you know, Victor Wembanyama has two missions here. One, to be the ultimate GOAT. Can you be the GOAT of this competition? But two, he's got to beat the rookies that he's going against here. So I definitely want to see if LeBron gives us any type of gameplay. LeBron versus Wemby, first matchup. We are on the road. We're taking it to him. Malice at the palace again. Too far? I don't know, but we destroyed him. Wemby. 36. Take it. LeBron struggling. Look at that shooting. It's not happening with LeBron. We are going to try to get gameplay with one of our rookie rivals. Where are 16 and three? Home. Here we go. This one could be a close one. I would love to be able to watch the end of a game here. Five point game. Wemby struggles in his first game. And Dwayne Wade stars. The bounce back though. Life is all about how you bounce back. And here we see Tim Thomas, a power forward. There's the point. There is the boy. As soon as he's an all-star, he's a man. Right now, maybe a boy. There's that man. Maybe one day, Dwayne Wade, you will be a career guy. But instead, instead, how do you guard him, Akeem? Maybe in his prime. This is a very old Hakeem. Hakeem has lost steam. We're skipping to the end. We won. We won. Congrats. Congrats. The real important things in this. Get into that all-star break. This is very interesting to see. What is happening with LeBron James right now? With the 2004 Detroit Pistons, they did take Darko Milicic. However, they famously passed on Melo. You see the All-Stars. Victor starting, right? Here we go. T-Mac, Allen Iverson, Paul Pierce. Victor Wembenyama, we are adding to the tracker. Career high currently, 47 points. Now, these are all going to be on the tracker as well. The league leader this season is Kobe Bean. 56, 20 boards in a game. 11 blocks! 11? That's wild. Okay, anyone else from our team? Michael Red and LeBron James, okay. Kobe Bean. Carmelo Anthony was coming into this rookie season fresh off a national championship victory at Syracuse. Think about that really. He was the national champion as a freshman, best player on the team, at a time where all the best players were playing in college. So anyway, we may have created an unbeatable challenge. Now keep in mind, we are tracking everything. So that is best overall seasons, best points per game, rebounds per game, assists per game. But a rookie MVP is going to be hard to top in this era challenge. 26.5 points, 13 rebounds. The 3.4 blocks are incredible, but he shot under 50%. This wasn't a perfect season from Wemby at all. Right away, we are hunting for that NBA championship. That MVP in year one is the goal and we hit it. Now let's see, can we get that title year one? Second team all NBA, Shaq, sorry man, take a seat. Dwayne Wade, third team all NBA, LeBron playing the Raptors in the first round. So Baron Davis joined Chris Bosh. The Spurs just with their their usual suspects with Jermaine O'Neal. That is wild. What did they finish? 61 and 21. Here are the final NBA standings. So the rule is going to be we simcast until we possibly get some gameplay. Hopefully. And once we get that gameplay, we only simcast in the NBA finals. We crush it though. There's Victor Wembenyama going off. But with 226 left, we have a tie game. We could get upset in the first round. Hello. So obviously we're not expecting an MVP from Wemby in real life right away, but three players have won an MVP in their first four seasons. Is there ever a time where we're just going to get over how tall he is? I'm not sure. Whoo! Vince Carter. Come on, man. Legacy's on the line. Vince is testing. That's a nice pull up. Chill. Bring it back. Yeah. Michael Red with that beautiful looking jumper. Vince Carter. He does not want to dunk and give us a highlight reel. He does want to look rugged. He looks like he had a rough night, but he is hitting that mid-range jumper very well. Bang! Woo! We're giving it to the MVP. That's kind of an open shot. Nope, doesn't matter. Big boy. Yo, yo, Hakeem, we get it. You're stronger. No timeouts left. They have to make a three. This has to go in or we win. Thank you. Let's see if we could just get right through this. And one more and one more. And there we are. Okay. LeBron, they take down in game seven. First of all, look at the upsets all around. So we are going to hopefully get to see some footage of Wemby versus LeBron. Okay. It's a one point game. 
one minute left. And they have the ball. Ben Wallace, you know, I just, I recently saw Ben Wallace and I felt really bad because he actually, Webby, big block. And here he is, he's going for it. You, why are you going for that? Come on, baby, I want this title. And this is directly against LeBron. We can't take this L. There's Bron. Those are some really long shorts. Webby affecting it. You smothered 96%. Bron, what you doing? What are you guys thinking? I mean, great 180 no scope. We continue. And we 2 1, 3 1, 3 2. We see. Can we close it out here? Can we? We are struggling. What has happened? I I thought we had this in the bag. I really thought we had this in the bag. Game seven. What has happened? I thought we were Tom cruising. They were getting accused of. Loving Scientology. Jumping on couches. Okay, so it didn't even become a series at the end. We just, we would love to play that eight seat Sonics and just grab a title. Hawks with Jason Terry and Sharif able to take it. I hope. 2-0. 3-0, Lakers 1-1. We sweep. Bring out the brooms. The Lakers are about to choke it away. That's, that's a big yikes. And we are in the NBA Finals. There's Gary Payton and no one. How did we get here? I'm not sure. Maybe they're a team of destiny. I'm hoping not. Right now, it's not looking like destiny is on their side. We have a very easy game one victory. I expect big things from LeBron. Michael Jordan, in this era, we see the capabilities of the teams I'm going to be able to construct. Barry's very open. That's a wild shot. Wemby, 100% smothered. Turk Lou's out there. We got that easy one. Milt, Milt, you are wild, bro. You're wild, Milt. Michael Rand, I believe in you. We have the same first name. Give that boy the ball. Here we go. Game two of the NBA Finals, one point game. Can Wemby get it done? He was passing it in, luckily. Michael Rand is so clutch. You kidding me? It don't mean a thing without a ring. And we know that, we know that. Here we are, 1-1, one, one, season one. We can get bounced at any point in season two. The 2K Sim can be wild, but instead we just win by 52, we just, Cost Seattle their franchise. I was worried. I'm not even looking. I'm looking. I'm definitely looking. Here we go. I mean, this is what we want. We're going to watch this one on broadcast Zoom. I'm going to watch the rest on 2K, but let me know if this is what you would prefer. Larry Hughes, it's a tough shot. We need to win. We love this play. Get it to the boy. Foul's call, foul's call. Gary Payton, 22 points. Wemby, I don't love the fact that they have an incredible shooter in Barry. Payton is forcing. That's a big force. And we know where to go with it. Does he, he, does he hit it? Gary Payton, all the way to the basket. On oh, Wendy! Fourth foul. I had no idea how many fouls he had. Here we go. Here we go. Gary Payton. Haunting Victor Wembenyama's nightmares. Game four of the NBA Finals. One point game. Victor Wembenyama with the ball. A chance to make history. He's posting. He wants it. He's going. He's... Michael Red! Victor Wembenyama! He's that guy! Here comes the pick. Gary Payton for the win! That guy. That guy. 3-1, here we go, boy. Simple. Season one wrapped. Victor Wembenyama, Finals MVP. Let's rack up all that he did in season number one. Career high, 48 points. We're rolling through all of these. We are going to be tracking every single one of these. So right now, 22 rebounds, that is a new record. Seven assists, I'm sure someone's gonna be breaking that. These are all the records, career stats. Does it matter? We hung on. In terms right now, uh, and then awards. MVP, champion, all-star, first team all defense, defense player of the year, first team all NBA. This is all about the collective though. So how far can we go? We will soon see. Year two. So headed into year two, we are going to essentially just jump over everything. We have an incredibly strong start. MVP and a championship. This is 2K though. As we're also wrapping up this 2004 draft where Dwight Howard goes to the Atlanta Hawks. Lester James. LeBron's State Farm is their cousin. Sean Livingston, Celtics, Ben Gordon, stolen by the Jazz. Andre Iguodala, Hornets. When we run through these simulations, what's going to be fun is the fact that we're going to be able to compare against each other. Now we have 4.86 million dollars to work with. Two years, boy. Okay. Okay. Got him. 
Jonathan Bender. Wemby, 89 overall. Comment below who you want to see next. I was actually thinking about doing Steph next. I don't know. That might be the most fun one. We also know that we probably... Do we do better with a passing point guard, right? So we have Larry Hughes. We can move him. But we want a... a not Sam Cassell, but a Sam Cassell type that's way younger. Darko, did Darko get worse? So headed into the season, we want to look at the power rankings. The Spurs, we avoided them in the playoffs. If we had to play the Spurs with Jermaine, I'm not sure. Shaq and Kobe have stayed together, of course, with Mike Miller. We're here. We're out here. I mean, it's not like we're not out here with our boy Jeffrey Glover, too. We are going to sim to the contract extension. I mean, why would we not have faith in the boys, right? Six and one, seven and one, eight and one. We are rolling i can only imagine this has got to be another mvp season for wemby we're 25 and 3 35 and 4 is already quite a season are we michael red wants to test free agency this is what i'm talking about so we have a 38 and 14 but we need to trade we cannot take that risk and so we can get ray though right away four years locked in and sam cassell for jake love though i don't know but ray Allen might be paul Pierce. Oh, Ron Ron. We are going to definitely go with Ron our test. St. John's own. Malice at the Palace no more. We are saving careers out here. That's what we do. So Larry is just down with a very nice, affordable contract. Thank you, Larry Hughes. The real question, storyline emerges. Are we going to be the same team without our star? We really are taking loss after loss. Okay, we're fine. What was the all-star voting like? Star participants, T-Mac, Wemby, LeBron, Michael Red. Imagine that name change to Mike. Mello, 44 and 9, 46 and 9. Joe Johnson was holding the, the squad to historic levels of greatness. This is wild. This is wild. This is wild. I can't believe this. I thought there would be a slip. Ronnie, what are you doing? Wemby with the MVP. We got the two MVPs. Scratch them off. Two. Boom, boom. The titles are going to be the hardest thing. The stats, the overall base stats are interesting. But the titles, man, they are definitely not guaranteed. Here's what we've got. We've got LeBron at Wemby's back. Dwayne Wade, suddenly second team All-NBA. And there is Mello. We are playing a young player, 29-year-old Allen Iverson in the first round of the playoffs. This is where we're supposed to be able to just sim. Looking around the league, got the Clippers. Memphis, number two. We got Powell. Kobe's not shoving them. The Lakers are not in the playoffs. And we are going to question why right now. They have Kobe and Shaq. You gotta be kidding me. One, that's not good. What has happened? We really have lost our team to this extent. Ron Artest has destroyed Victor Wembenyama's legacy. We're just gonna slowly, we're good. Okay, we are on to game five. At this point, yeah, we're simcasting. We're worried. Um, okay, not worried. Wemby crushing, sim through game. Dude! By the way, this is an era challenge, so if you are enjoying today's video, make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications. That way, you do not miss the next video that is going to be Victor Wembenyama in Michael Jordan's era with a young Kobe, a young Shaq. And then from there, we're either going to the modern NBA or the 80s. Now let's continue on with Victor Wembenyama's journey versus LeBron. Game seven in the first round! You gotta just win this. Easy. Easy. Chris Bosh coming at us. LeBron, of course, not fumbling. The Hawks with Dwight to simulate through. Just come on, right? We're easy. It's never easy. Okay, and we can. Yes, one more. That was easy. LeBron, you're about to fumble. LeBron! La choke. We said it. The other end, Memphis and San Antonio. San Antonio is the actually loaded roster as they sweep the number one seed. The Jazz go down. Poor Darko. He starts. He starts. Dark. No. No. The worst starter ever. Well, anyway, Eastern Conference Finals. We could get some uh, Dwight Wemby action if they... They're not even contested. They're not even contested. No contest. No contest. As we go into the NBA Finals versus the Spurs. Suddenly the boys have figured it all out. Suddenly Jay Glove, Finn and Laika. We'll take a title. We'll take a title. Okay, okay. Two, 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 two. We can't fumble. At the end of the day, the MVPs are gonna come. But winning the title, this is where it matters. I thought we were so good after we just blew them out game seven we are at home oh my gosh Bruh. guys and everyone it all comes down to this we are in game seven lock me in there's jermaine o'neal and he 
just going to work right away. Is LeBron taking the first two titles in this era challenge? When I'm able to be the GM? Probably. Three point San Antonio lead. How is he to always guard Jermaine? No. No! Not Jermaine Odium. Violation. Sir. Tony Parker, Earl Boykin's sub. Makes sense, makes sense. Here we go. Here we go, here we go. Woo! No! No! What? When? Why? That doesn't make sense. There's been so much that has happened in 45 seconds. That's just not a good shot, but there's Webby. He's trying. We're doing what we can. Oh no. Oh no. Saucin? Blocking. Blocking. I'm feeling it. What are we talking about? Where is the foul? Ball does lie at times. Ladies and gentlemen, it looks like we may have a blown NBA Finals on our hands. Up 2-0, man. He do? Heed, ew, ew, we get it. Heed, ew, we get it. That's the headline. Heed, ew, Tim Duncan and the San Antonio Spurs win the title. Have to remember this feeling, Wemby. Remember the feeling, Wemby. We have to point out, you know, the irony that Victor Wembanyama in LeBron James draft class is losing to his team. Where? Why is our player there? Got work left to do. Hall of Fame inductees, Gary Payton. Okay, we get it. I have wandered into my pick here. I see Gortat. Not bad. All right, we'll, we'll take Gortat, but looking at the 2005 draft, we see Chris Paul goes to the Toronto Raptors with Dwayne Wade. Baron Davis is quite a player. Brian Grant, we move that contract later on. I believe in this. B. Diddy. Here we go. Gary Smiles, not bad. Can we get him? Are you gonna? Yes, we got him. Nice. Okay, player progression, Wemby to a 92, to a near three. That's not even wildly crazy. Like, you know, we got Gilbert, 94. Kobe's a 99. So it is year three. We need to improve the small forward or power forward position. Quinton Richardson, going for it. Charlie Villanueva, not even a bat. Not at all. We got Q, we got Baron, we got Ron Ron. So Jermaine Jones and Jonathan Bender both only have one year contracts. We're gonna need to get value out of them anyway, but we can keep Hedu. So maybe we just trade these guys. A first round pick from the Houston Rockets. I'm liking, I'm liking the first round pick. Okay, year three, power rankings. Lakers, number one last year, didn't even make the playoffs somehow. This year with their boy Rex, Shane Battier. That's a great addition. And David West, okay. Pistons are maintaining. Haven't really added anything wild. We're right here. This is our starting lineup. Baron, Q, Ron, Hedu, and Wemby. Chris Paul, Dwayne Wade, Vince Carter. They have the three. They, so that is a very interesting team to be looking at. Let's go for this. Lose the first game of the season. Not the best. We are suddenly... Wemby's averaging 30 a game and we're two and five. We were at a point where it looked like we were going all the way. It looked like we were never going to not win an MVP in a title. At this point, we are suddenly a struggle city team. Is it Ron? Now with Victor Wembanyama actually, of course, in real life, the GOAT case here. I'm really excited to see what he's able to do. Now we did see in the summer league, a first game where he had all the expectations on the world in him, but he scored under 10 points. I find that interesting. You know, it is a summer league game. He was taking a lot of tough tough shots i think if Wemby just played within himself fully and was not trying to expand his skill set in the summer league he would have just been absurdly dominant i mean he's seven foot four if he just stood around the rim we saw the shot blocking Wemby, lebron there's wade there's vc the shots Wemby missed in, his, in the first game though were very tough i really love the fact that he rebounded though in such an incredible ridiculous way we watched all of the hate in the world rain down on that man as we have become the best team in the nba well, we watched all the hate rain down on that guy. You know, it's to the point where every single time you check your phone, all this is hate, hate, hate after that game. And how did he respond? He came out, no way! This is actually not at all. No, no, you have to be kidding. We, how have we fallen so off? Chris Paul, rookie of the year. Defensive player of the year wasn't even Wemby. How is Ron averaging less than 10 points a game? Oh, no. Look at the numbers this man put up. This is where we're at at this point. Three first team all NBA. Game highs, 52. We haven't checked this in a bit. This is what we will check all the way at the end. I <laughs> hurt. LeBron, man, did it to me. They are the one seed. This is wild. This is wild. When we run this with LeBron, what's going to happen? Melo coming alive too. Wow. Bosh, 13 rebounds a game. Going against the Milwaukee Bucks. They have Nate Robinson. We are simming through. Let's win, win. Please. Can we just sim cast right away? Okay. 2 1. 3 1. Oh, 
Let's look at, you know. Okay, four. Of course, the pistons over there. Sweet pistons. Through the Pistons, they took a loss. We were playing the Hawks, by the way. Terry, they have Michael Red. What if he becomes Mike in front of our eyes? Three one. Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. You and Mellow even reached Mellow with Marcus Can. It's just Mellow. Corey McGetty, wow. Okay. Okay. Two zero. Oh. Here we go. I can't believe what has happened to us. Come on. Come on. Comfortably win at the end. And we Whew. All right, Sim Caston. Crushing. I thought we were crushing. Are we, go are we pulling away or not? It looked like we were. Got close. It got close on us. They're now home. We pulled back, though. Come on. Come on, guys. This is so nerve wracking. Are we able to get close enough to get the Sim? Oh my gosh. We're not even there. We're not even there. 3 2. And the Lakers are 2 2. We have. To. Come on. We lasered. We locked it here. That simple. That simple. We're on to a game set. They're at home. We're holding on strong. Oh no. Okay. No way! We don't even get a chance to show ourselves in the game! Eliminated. We have been thrown for a loop and they win it! LeBron does it to our face? I don't know what to say. I'm frazzled. Do we have a chance at a pick? We do, we do. I we actually do. Boom! If I had gotten that pick, honestly, it would have been nice. We need to fix things. JJ, fresh out of Duke. Remember, this was an incredibly weak draft, 2006 draft, uh, LaMarcus Aldridge. We know what we need to do. I'm sorry, Ron Ron. I'm sorry, boy. But we can get Ray. I'm pretty sure that's what we're doing. Ray Allen, though, it's what the people want. We know it. We know it. Bring the people's champ. We're in year, we did year three, two MVPs and one title. Like that is not going to win the challenge. I would love Rashard Lewis at that power forward spot. Is that possible? Agreed, agreed. Hidu Turkulu is a small forward now. Look at this squad now. Do we get 5 million again? 3.3 this year. It's a little bit of a pay cut. Earl Jenkins is gonna be a big part of this team along with, I wanna get JJ some minutes at that eight spot. Do we have what it takes. Troy Pistons, number one. Chad Stewart, LeBron, Boozer. There goes Ben Wallace. Los Angeles Lakers, we know what we're doing. We are going through it. We now have the best team in the world. Eight and oh, nine and oh. Oh man, what? And we sit back. You have to be kidding. I went to, we are, we are fallible. We have to understand. You know, it's an important thing in life. You understand you are able to fall and you rise at every point in your life, as long as you build upon yourself. You know, you build upon your mistakes. Right now, what are we doing? This is a metaphor for life. We had it easy. We thought that things were going so well, that things were, it was impossible to shake us. Today's a trade down. We are going to stop. We are going to make sure we're putting in the effort because we thought we had it all made. And then now look, Richard Lewis is leaving after this year. Barry Davis could be leaving after this year. We could get back our guys. We always do that. Okay. So we can get back you boys. Love that, love that, love that. Richard wants to test free agency, but we're taking this risk. We're going for it. We are trying to make this work. Please, absolutely mega blockbuster trade reported. We are able to trade for Chris Bosh. We need this title, but we got Bosh. We're gonna see how Chris Bosh fits in. I think this is gonna be great, I would imagine. Year four, we just need to win this year. We're Look at those wins. All we see is wins no matter what. Oh, this is, this is ridiculous. Okay, our team is, our team is wild. No, no, what is happening? Yo, Webby, one MVP in four now. Or two? No, he has two, he's two, he's two MVP. Kobe, Wade is now first team NBA. Right with Wemby. Mello, T Mac. We were the one seed. What happened? We won 70 games. We're ridiculous now. Look at this squad 27, 15, and 4. You can say I'm frazzled. You can say what you need to say. My goal, my job is to win us titles, it's to get Wemby the GOAT spot. And LeBron's doing it to me in front of me. That he is the simulation. We're sim casting any important games. This is wild. Please don't tell me. Please, just please, please, please. There we go, there we go, there we go. There we go. We're not even worried about it. We weren't even worried about it. We are playing the Toronto Raptors. We're sim casting. Chris Paul's already at 90. We're sim casting. From now on in the playoffs, we sim cast. This is where we're at. Love that, love that. When we're, when we're one ahead, we can we can go ahead. We can, we can just sim. Feels like we could lose that. Okay, there we go. We're safe. 
We're so safe. Bring out the brooms. Bring them out. Bring them out. The Phoenix Suns, top seed, gone. Lakers, gone. We, of course, do have LeBron. We are simcasting this. We're playing the MVP. How to beat him. How has this happened? Ray Ray, 38 for you. What you doing, Brownie? Okay, not even, I think, yo, Mello and the Nuggets. I'm not even looking at the left. I'm so lazy. Why is that jumping up? What happened? 36 to 18 in the third? Yo, look at that second half, man. One foul for Wemby. He's out there the whole game just floating around. LeBron is becoming the goat in front of our eyes. Gotta do this. I'm so comfortable. All right, all right, we're good, we're good, we're good. Whoever we're playing, we gotta just take him down. LeBron versus Wemby as rookies with the ultimate real life battle imagine we are crushing wow dominating performance not like Wemby is doing it though just get to the finals get to the finals please three point lead for us thankfully okay i thought we were just massively fumbling instead Wemby for three what are you okay i reckless so reckless i'm cheering for it just because i like the idea of it in theory as Get out of here! Boozer. What? LeBron! No! No! Look at that. Smothering defense. Smothering, smothering. LeBron though. You got it. He's that guy! Three point game. Have to lock it in. Have to lock it in. Chris Bosch, oh yeah, you're on our team. Talk it over, baby. Talk it over. You're not making that. That's wild. They don't have shooters. They don't have shooters. That's crazy. Thank you. So year four, we head to the NBA Finals. Victor Wembanyama takes down LeBron James. And now it's looking like the Spurs again. Okay. Take care of business. And then we need to win the MVP next year. I'm hoping that Wemby can end with three. This has taken such a wild turn in terms of a five-year arc. We destroyed in game one to the point where it was embarrassing though, so I'm really hoping that we don't. Okay, game two, NBA Finals. Victor Wembanyama versus the San Antonio Spurs and a prime Tim Duncan. This is exactly what history would love to see. There he is. There he is. On, on, Tim Duncan literally stops him. Oh my God. Oh, there it is. Come on. That's a steal! Chris Bosch! The incredible addition! There it is. One more? Okay, and we're passing, we're being patient. And we're hidden! Come on! Tim Duncan, the big boy born. Victor Wimbanyama can win at the NBA Finals right now. Game two. NBA Finals can be won! Chris Bosch for the win! Ah! And they're running all the way. Why is JJ out there? Not to, not to Bosch, not to Bosch. Okay, I don't know what this play is. Yup, swinging around right to Wemby. There we go. Now dunk on him. Can we dunk on him again? That's a big board, please. Yes! This is wild. This is wild. It's all down to this. No! Tim Duncan versus Victor Wembenyama. And we're watching. Timmy, go for it. Ah, oh, here we go, Victor Wembanyama, NBA Finals on the line, Big Green! Tie game, needs to make it to give the Cavaliers a lead. And they're running, they're going to Duncan, we know it! We know where they're going! Can Bosch? Oh my, oh my, come on! Do not settle, don't settle! All the way! Chance to win, they've got to be out of timeouts! MVP, the crowd chants MVP as he shoots a free throw. Please, to win the NBA Finals, potentially. Ah! And they really do have a timeout. They have 90 timeouts. Okay, we're going to one minute left of overtime two. It is a tie game. We have the ball. Here we go. Here we go. That's wildly, how do you miss? Oh my, okay, here we go. Wow, wow. Tim Duncan puts it up. Running a different offense, okay. There it is, they're running with the double. We're going for the win! JJ! Oh! 
JJ! One point game, NBA Finals. Tony Parker passes. Steven Jackson for the win. Can't believe it. Can't believe it. Can't believe it. Oh my, what has happened to the Cleveland Cavaliers? We had it all. We won the title year one. We were at the top of the mountain. Can we come back? Come on. We're stronger than this, please, please. Wow. Okay, now we're just destroying? Okay, okay, okay. We were never worried. We were never even worried. <sighs> remember that time we were, we were worried? I can't remember. I'm trying to think of it. I'm, okay, whatever. We will take this incredible sim win. We will take this. <sighs> Champions, Victor is the victor. That's an NBA Finals. We have one more season left. It's been a two-time MVP, a two-time champion so far. One season left, four-time All-Star, four-time first-team All-NBA, two-time Defensive Player of the Year, only two. Four-time first-team All-Defense, sure, but you know, this is gonna be 52 points. That's a good amount, but I feel like someone will top it. 19 free throws made might not be topped. 20 field goals. 26 rebounds. What does Prime Will Chamberlain do? 11 blocks. He did that as a rookie. I mean, we won the championship, but we need the best season ever. We are at the draft. Greg Oden, Kevin Durant on the Warriors. Joe Kim Noah on the Mavericks. Wemby's trying to leave me for the Rockets. It's okay, we're taking him back. And Chris Bosh is trying to leave me for the Heat. Shut the lights out. Taking Mike Miller. Love this. Okay, taking our $3 million thing. Oh, Jared Wallace? Of course. Jared Wallace. That is a great signing. 96 overall, 90 Bosh, 87 Ray Allen. I can't believe JJ hit that shot. I can't believe JJ hit that shot for nothing. There's so much we don't need to worry about now because it is the last year. Lakers still have kept Shaq and Kobe in this universe. Curious what happens as we continue to go through what happens with Steph or LeBron. Comment below who you want to see next. Things like the wins record and stuff would be nice by year five. We'd be trying. Okay, five and one, six and one. Okay, so the wins record is 74 wins. It's pretty hard to beat. You know, you can only lose seven of them. We have two, three. That's three, four, okay. So it's not looking like we're gonna take the wins record, which is okay. I really thought when we started beginning this that this legacy challenge, that this was going to be, oh wow, Wemby's gonna set the bar too high. But suddenly there is just so much to possibly catch, except for this could be the wins record. This could be the wins record. Watch us win. That is, I, I, I still refuse. Watch us win. We don't need trades. Watch us win. Thank you. Okay. Final all-star participants. We have Dwayne Wade. Bosh with me. Chris Paul. We can lose one more game. Okay. There's the one. We are so far doing so. Imagine. Come on, boys. Come on. Okay. Well, can we tie the wins record? Wins record is 73 wins. Right? We had we had eight. Hold up. I'm doing the incorrect math. They say math isn't important. Watch what happens. Watch what happens. You know, suddenly next thing you know, we're taking L's. Wemby takes home the MVP. Thankfully. Thankfully. LeBron Defensive Player of the Year, though. Okay, so we're gonna count up everyone's stuff at the end. We took 71 wins, though. I mean, incredible season. That is going to be a record in itself, team success. So 71 wins is the record for our leaderboard. Final standings, we had 71. Pistons, 58. They actually have gotten a bit worse, I feel like so. We should just be able to sim through these games. We should just be able to sim through these games. We should just be able to sim through. We are doing so. Love that. Who do the Knicks have? Devin Harris and Jermaine O'Neal. He has left the San Antonio Spurs. 2-0, come on. Okay, this could just be an easy season. We don't need to sweat and goodbye LeBron. Hello, Tracy McGrady. 99 overall to Jay Williams. There's one, and there's two, and there's three. We love that, we love that, we love that. Love that! Sweeping our way, and wow! The Nuggets made it to the NBA Finals. This is just, this is just where we're at, man. It's just where we are at. We are crushing, crushing. Come on, Wemby, close it out. The fifth year, the fifth year. You need to be the most dominant. A sweep in the finals would be the most dominant way to go out. We are comfortable. We are nice and comfortable. I'm just doing that though. That is 0 for 8 from three. The basket is looking small. We're hoping that that changes in game three. Here we go, here we go. Pushing this is a somewhat close one. But somewhat, you know, four point game in the fourth. Wow, hold away, hold away, hold away. And we could be sweeping. It could be so simple. Come on, Victor Wembenyama. They're trying at the end, but it is to no. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, we finished off strong. There's that guy. There's that guy. Look at, loves the fan. We almost choked everything away. Had the best beginning, had an incredible end. The middle was rocky. But there's that man, there's that guy. Finals MVP, 
There we go. Finish it off, baby. This is how it ends. Victor Wembenyama, three MVPs, three titles. We have five first team all NBAs. He was always that guy, but only two defensive player of the years, actually. 57 points is solid. I think that will be beaten though, eventually. 39 field goals attempted. 20 free throws made, very solid. Chris Bosch is one of the guys we actually were Looking at, he had 50. Two-time NBA champion, three-time All-Star, three-time second-team All-NBA. Dwayne Wade, who ended up a three-time All-Star, one-time first-team All-NBA, four-time first-team All-Defense. He was All-NBA every single time, five times, wow. But LeBron was, of course, the real competition. Two-time MVP to me, one-time champion. Five-time All-Star, four-time first-team All-NBA. We outdueled him. He had the same amount of defensive player of the years. These will count for the LeBron James leaderboard. The LeBron James era challenge will be coming. For now, we are going to be continuing on with the Victor Wembenyama era challenge. So make sure to subscribe and turn on post notifications. That way you do not miss the next video on this channel. What if Victor Wembenyama goes up against a prime Michael Jordan in that era? It's going to be a rookie Kobe. It's going to be a young Shaq directly. It's going to be very, very exciting. And then we have to decide, do we want to go to the modern era or do we want to go back to the 80s that's also something i want you to comment let me know let me know how you enjoyed this video thank you for watching again i hope you enjoyed it thank you for supporting you're awesome we all know it and as always have an awesome day cue that music